Good morning, Market Watch. Happy Tuesday, isn't it? It's it's a good day, right? So this is gonna be the last banger for the year, and then on the January first, we're gonna be back with new market, same BS as always. So uh, let's dig on into your favorite segment of Wow. Genesis Impact is going up even more, shall we? What a freaking shocker that is. Remember, so it's bad, you shouldn't buy it. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. So down in Magicians skyrocketed, right? Like, this is, uh, this is a yikes. So you're looking at $18 for secrets. Uh, first ads are about 19 and as you can see, you only have the two listings here. Premium gold versions of these are nine bucks. Hello? Material? Is that you? And then, yeah, the 2014 version's down here. $12 as well. So, uh, am I shocked about this buyout? No. Um, it's an extra material for Zeus which basically will enable two board wipes. It's, that's where you're getting your real value out of this, is that extension board wipe that players are valuing quite highly, actually. So, uh, yay, down or buy out. My favorite. Ah, Union Carriers. Evidently, these have uh, gone up a little bit. Uh, the $7 copies are, well, once the last two are gone here, you're going to eight bucks. Um, you still have 95 listings. It's not like a power buyout, but yeah, union carriers are slowly disappearing off of the market at this point in time. So bad news. If you want, if you guys wanted some union carriers, probably should have got them a little while ago. But overall, it looks like the bottom price point on these is uh, disappearing. Ah, this one's cool. Hey, so have you guys paid attention to the price on Ash Blossom and Joy of Spring? So. Original copies for Unlims, 45 bucks. First editions on the other hand, light place at 55 and then $59. Now, it gets, what, what's your bottom line for Ash Blossom? 14 bucks, 11 bucks, 12 bucks, 12 bucks, 11, 12 bucks, 11 bucks, 13 bucks. Your bottom line for Ash Blossoms in all printings at this point are officially $11. All right, now think about that. It means that the value on this card has finally settled and not at a good price point either. That's a little bit scary, actually. Overdrive teleporters. Um, I guess I blinked on this. These have gone even further beyond their original buyout. $48 today for these. Uh, I still think that this is a ridiculous buyout, but alas, here we are. So if you've got overdrive teleporters, go sell them. Now, go make that free money, because this is dumb. It really is. Oh, Sky Scourge Altis. Are these really up? Like, is this... Actually happened. Fifty-five. Ugh. All right. Well, that's all right. Sure. Invincible. Um. Cool. I guess Invincible's got bought out too. Uh, twenty-seven bucks for him. And then Enrise here. Um. Looks like. All right. Cool. To page three. And rise is 50, but you got some 25 light plays. Huh. Sky Scourge Altis all across the board are worth some sort of value. That's kind of interesting, actually. I guess the more you know. All right, Blue Eyes Alternative. White Dragons. 15 bucks. Eh, basically 15 bucks. Basically 15 bucks. Uh, 2093. Nope, nobody's going to touch that. But for the most part here, interesting enough that these are at 15 bucks. Huh. Still not quite sure how I feel about that. What's going on with these WJPP promos? Um, 3,000 for 2018. 2019's, uh, looking at 1,600 unopened. Red Eyes Alone is five. Monster Reborn is five. Okay. 
Dark Magician Girl's 35 grand. Huh. Interesting. No Monster Reborn or Dark Magicians from the other sets. Oh, interesting. You, you guys know that you topic Kaiser. Once this cheap copy's gone, we're back at nine bucks. I, I don't think a lot of you guys pay attention or really care about you topic Kaiser, but that's kind of interesting. Um, huh. All right. Dragon Master Knight. So this was pointed out to me that these uh, legendary collection versions actually have skyrocketed recently. Uh, Five fifty first edition is going to run you about the six dollar mark. I'm uh, inherently not too sure where this went. Wait, what? Is this really four bucks? What? When did this become a four dollar card? Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold up here. Okay, hold up. What's going on with this set? Okay, so I see Lambda here at 24. Faris at 19 bucks. Increase of 15. Sarah's are up. We knew that. Dragalongs, nines. Okay, that's stuff I knew. But what? Dugress is seven. We knew that. Summon limits are sixes. We knew that. Widow Anchors are fours. Secret Lands, he has a fours. This is really a $4 card. Basically $5, actually. Dragon Nether Souls from this set are 4 bucks too? What? That, okay. Sure. Haven't heard Slave Saviors a $3 card? What in the, this is 2 bucks. What happened to this Battles of Legend? Wow. Huh. Well, all right. Free money, I guess, right? Who are we to deny free increases like that? Huh. Interesting. All right. Warning Point is still a 6 $7 card, depending on how you want to look at it. Um, I still think that this card's going to bottom out, seeing zero play in today's metagame. Uh, once a reprint comes around the corner and goes bonk, um, it's, it's dead. Ah, hey, Secret Zeros. Hmm. Did you guys know that these uh, beautiful secrets are uh, actually like 50 bucks in your mint? Hmm. Sad part is, is uh, I have like three of these. Huh. Cool. Dragon Maids. Oh, Chambers are 250s. Ugh. Hospitalities are bought out. <laughs> oh, man, they nailed, they nailed it. Hospitality's done. GG do re. Like, they actually nail coffined it. Wow. Wow. I can't believe that. Jigga yikes. Chambers are 30 bucks. Man. Hmm. Lepores are 4 bucks. Huh. Welcomes are 4 bucks. Did I just. Is there just like a general increase on cardboard value right now? Because, uh. Wow. So much value. All right, Nightmare Phoenix CRs. Hey, look, still up there. Unicorns back down to 70s. All right, Artemis is at 50 bucks. Metronius here at 42. These CRs are so cheap, man. Novas as of this morning are 41 bucks. All right, Renonas are 38 bucks. So uh, yeah, um, this set's so cheap. It's it's absurd. Yay, free value! Alright. Speed Duel Box. Huh, 13 bucks. Hmm. Rota's 8 bucks. Dark Paladin's 8 bucks. Dark Magician, 7 bucks. Um, yeah. You guys remember when you shouldn't buy the Speed Duel Box? It's not going to have value? <laughs> yeah, imagine being wrong. This box is so much free real estate. Like, this is actually ridiculous. I love. Really, Night Assailants are three, two, three dollars. Huh. Spook Answers are dollars. All right. Interesting. Ah. Heavenly Sears. Huh. These are seven bucks. Ah, American Copies are eights. Interesting. Huh. All right. Heliopolis is still five bucks. Sukis or Suk, three, four. Well, I just think that this stuff still has some decent value. Huh. Moving on along, Harold's, huh? You have one cheap copy at 47, then you're back up to 60. Enjoy. Uh, purples are still like 80 bucks. Nobody's paying this. Nobody. 
Scarlet Zanguines are still $3 plus the young shipping. Cloud Castle, basically 2 bucks per copy. Yay, shipping. Uh, Gaia, the Fierce Knight Origin. These are, well, the super cheap, actually, for zero, zero, zero. But the uh, sneak peek version of this, I just want to point out here. So we show off the one version just so I can go, oh, hey, by the way, uh, the other version is dumb. Oh, still 83s on the deers. All right, good value. You guys ready for, you can have the one crappy copy for 40 cents, or you can have the $11 copy. Huh. Also, Biaz is still an $11 card. Black Lush Soldier of Chaos, right back on up to the 105 mark. Do, 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 do. If you bought the $80 copy over the weekend, you won. Uh, Mind August, still a $5, $6 card, and then DTs are 9s. Ice Dragons Prisons are 37s today. Lambdas are 24s. Lightning Storms are down to 77 bucks, And then uh, Skullmeisters are down to a young 66 for this one copy, and then up to 75 here. Whee! So guys, what do you think about today's market? Please leave a comment down below. Tell me what you guys think. Tell me those New Year's resolutions down below in the comment section. I'll see your beautiful faces later on in the day for some more cool content. Peace out, guys. Thank you, patrons, for making the ride never truly end without you guys' support. Well, I would probably be doing Drupal Shuffle videos for a living. Guys, please check out Vancall 40 for all of your Cardfight Vanguard content brought to you by Mcall 40 And... If you are looking to pick up singles, check out mcolgames.com for your trading card game needs. Thanks for watching, everybody.